All right, welcome back to LearnWire. Today we're going to look at VideoTap one last time, at least while it's on AppSumo. Now, this is a video repurposing uh, content platform. It's much like Cast Magic and other tools that allow you to upload your YouTube video or podcast, and then it turns that content, it takes that audio, right? And it transcribes it, and then it can create blog posts for you. It can create social media posts, and it uh, can chop up your video into shorter form clips that you can go and upload <clears throat> as YouTube shorts, TikTok videos, Instagram reels, et cetera, et cetera. Now, VideoTap, I'm gonna show you the results that I've gotten from it, and then we're gonna go and do a unique process that I'm gonna try out right now, and I'll keep you guys updated if this improves rankings, but we're already getting page one rankings with VideoTap, so it's really, really cool. Now, I would recommend this specifically if you have a podcast or a YouTube channel. And if you wanna do what I call video first blogging, then this is a perfect tool for you because you'll be able to create your YouTube videos like I'm doing right now. And then you would be able to repurpose that and create a really nice blog post. And it's very personalized and for, written in first person format. It, it writes from an expert standpoint and it just will really help with the EEA T score, I believe, because it's going to be unique content that is written based on your YouTube video or your YouTube review in my case. Okay. Okay, so this is a software that is going away. I'm recording this right now on June 25th. You're going to see this on Wednesday morning. I'll get this out early Wednesday morning for you guys. And you're going to, by the time this um, hits, you'll still have until June 28th, right? So you're going to see this on early on June 26th, so 27, 28. So you're going to have two full days because we can come down and see that this is ending in three days at the time of recording. But when you guys see this, it's going to be two days. So you're going to want to act fast if this is something you would like to do. Now, I did get a free version of this, I believe, when I did my very first review on this. But I liked the software so much that I went and actually purchased License Tier 3 with my own money because this is when it unlocked Claude 3 Opus. Now we're on uh, another version of Claude. We have a newest version of Claude where I'm hoping that they're, they'll update this to the newest version of Claude. Let me go see what if I can find what it's called. If I go in here and type and then right over here, look, we have Claude 3.5 Sonnet or Sonnet. Now, Claude 3 Opus, they're moving very quick. Opus has only been out for a couple months, and then now they've already moved to their newest most intelligent model, which is Sonnet, okay? So I'm thinking that VideoTap will actually be offering that as well. So they've actually, so what has ended up happening is that they had 3.0 Sonnet, and then they went with Claude 3 Opus, and then now they're saying that there's a Claude 3.5 Sonnet. So then now this one is taken over. I mean, it's hard to keep up with this stuff. I'm sure you guys uh, would agree that they're just playing with us, right? Now they're using another the a previous language, but then now they're upgrading it. And then now it's going to trump Claude 3 Opus. Super funny stuff to me. But nonetheless, I'm sure this will get updated. But I did purchase License Tier 3. And it's going to allow me to not worry about the amount of, because I create long videos, right? So I need a lot of content right over here. So we're going to go and take a look at some of the results. And then I'm also going to be using Neuron Writer. Now, Neuron Writer is also going away in a couple days as well. So let me go and duplicate this real quick. And I'm going to go to ending soon. And you're going to see right over here that Neuron Writer is also leaving in what they're saying in uh, 38 hours, less than two days. Now, this has been on the platform for a couple of years now, and so it was voted AppSumo's 2023 Tool of the Year by the community. So if you don't already have this, you need to go and pick it up. If you do anything with blogging, SEO, or anything like that, you need to go and pick this up. I don't know if they're just going to redo the offer. I mean, I, I wouldn't you know, history would show that they wouldn't really be leaving. But you never know, right, when they're finally ready to leave the platform, that could be possible as well. So just giving you a heads up, you know, if I had to make a guess, they'll probably, you know, renew the offer. But there's no guarantee of that, right? I don't have any insight or any, you know, secret details or anything like that, or else I would share that with you guys. But just want to give you guys a heads up as well. We're going to be using NeuronWriter as well to do this as well. So we're going to be creating a post. But just to show you right over here, 
We have video tap. I've done three articles that I've tracked right over here. We have a, a number seven ranking right over here for a keyword that gets traffic. We have Doc Analyzer right over here and Tube Sift, right? And so what ends up happening is, and the, this is a site with no backlinks, no authority, relatively new site, but it's ranking uh, on page one, page two for these um, articles right over here. And essentially I'm doing, you know, if I go to my YouTube channel and we go and look at my YouTube channel, you'll see, I mean, I mostly do reviews, right, on this channel. And these are my videos that I'm, that we are actually, and then I have, Another person that I have hired, Michaela, to come on and help me with reviews as well. And hopefully we'll be um, seeing Paul this week or next week as well. But we are a team doing software reviews and we are actually diving in and doing real software reviews. We're getting our hands on the software and we're diving in and, and doing a full in-depth reviews, right? So it would make sense that we would be able to be, get a little bit of authority and come off as experts when we are doing spending this much time in the reviews. And so we're using these this AI tool, VideoTap, to grab one of these videos and actually create an article from it, okay? So this is like a form of blogging and I think that this is the next level, if you will, Spe especially if you're going to do YouTube first, this is a really good approach, in my opinion, and it seems to be working right now for me. So we're going to go in and we are going to go with zebra cat. So I'm going to go zebra cat AI review is going to be the keyword. So we're going to go in or make sure to pick up a copy of neuron writer, I'll leave a copy or a link to video tap. Obviously, I believe I gave it like a 4.5 stars. I'll leave a link to video tap below and then also a, a link to neuron writer. This might be a potent combination of tools, a workflow that we're going to be uh, trying out right now. Okay. So I'm going to go log in real quick and I'm going to select my project. It's been a while since I've been inside uh, and used this because let me go ahead and just tell you that the rankings that I'm getting over here, guys, I haven't done any SEO. There's no NLP keywords inserted into these uh, posts right over here. There's no anything that I'm doing that's a specific strategic on-page SEO technique. I literally just grabbed my URL, pasted it into VideoTap, and then basically double-checked everything, maybe made some pricing adjustments and things like that. And then I pushed publish. There's no FAQs in these. There's no keyword stuffing. There's no NLP keywords. There's no anything, semantic related keywords. There's no hardcore SEO going on. And we're still getting page one results right here. Okay. But I want to do another test. I want to see if we combine SEO strategies with the combination of real world experience of the actual review and putting those together if we can even get better results, right? So that's kind of the, the point of this video. So we're going to go over here. We're going to go new. This definitely, the, the layout of this has changed uh, since the last time that I have logged in. I'm going to go in here and paste in our, our keyword and push start. So it's going to go and analyze for us while it's doing that, right? We're going to go over here and we're going to find the video on Zebra Cat further down. Of course, I need to come over here and see if I have already posted it just to double check and make sure I haven't already posted it. Doesn't look like I have. Good. So we'll come over here and we'll grab Zebra Cat. We will right click and we will copy the link address. And then we will come into Video Tap and log in. And for whatever reason, get the use your email address to log in to, Zebra, to Video Tap. They don't actually have the email by Google login, if you will. All right, so we are going to go into videos and they have a little warning up here impacting an issue impacting exporting clips. I'm not using this surprisingly. I'm not using this. I think that most people are just using this as the, you know, min, like a Minvo Opus clip alternative, right? And it's all about the the short clips that it's creating and so forth. I'm using it just as their blog writer and I went all in with the tier 3, which is crazy. Probably a unique customer of theirs that sees the value of using their blog writer. So what I'm going to do is come back over here and see it pulls my videos. All I have to do is just grab check mark that and say add video. And then we come over here. I think I already did this one. Let me see if I can click on it. Yeah, we've already done this one. So we've done this one already, which is great. It gives us a description. We can go ahead and grab this description right over here. And we can go into our editor and go all the way down to put in our <clears throat> of course, I have S I have a, a Squirrely SEO installed, and then I also have 
I believe it's Yoast installed as well. So we'll go over here, we'll put the Meta in right there. It's a little long. I think I'll take that part off right there. See if that helps. Yep, we're back in the green, looking good. And then what we'll do is we'll shape this up to ZebraCat AI review. So we'll take this part off and we're SEO'd, ready to go right there. And then this is ZebraCat, it's more of a video. So I'm gonna select video right there. And that's good. And then we'll just go and save, save as pending. And then we'll come back over here and I'll go ahead and grab the, I'm actually gonna take the AppSumo part off. I'm just gonna grab this title right here. And then we're gonna go into NeuronWriter because it should be done. So it's saying it's a seven competition score. We'll go and click on the keyword and open up the SEO part. Okay, so we're gonna just leave that and go to next. I don't really like the the new layout personally because it shrinks the screen. That's just me. They're always, you know, it just, sometimes I just don't know where these improvements were, quote unquote, are improvements, but in my opinion, they're just not, but that's just me. All right, so we're gonna go, we're gonna put our title in. I guess we can put in our description real quick. Save and close. And then we'll put the rest of the article. I need to click over here to content. And this would be the blog post. And of course, I would do some editing as well. Let's see if they did bring in any images at all. If not, I'm gonna go ahead and add some images. So pricing plan, we'll see if we can add this screenshot right here with a pricing plan. Yeah, I'm not seeing the pricing plan right there, but we'll go ahead and just leave that one right there like that. And I'll just copy this text all the way up to the top. And we'll copy that and we'll go into Neuron Writer and then we'll paste our article in right over here, okay? So we have our article in right over here and you can see that our score is a 41. It's not bad, it's not in the 30s, so that I, I like that. And this is just gonna be based off of things that I said in the review, right? So there's n there's been no SEO, no NLP keywords, nothing done, and we're getting an over 40 score right there, which is pretty cool. I would expect it to be in the 30s or even the 20s because we had did no research of keywords, nothing like that, right? Remember, this is based off of just a video transcript, and uh, I might add an unscripted video transcript. But we are getting a lot of green right over here. We're hitting words right over here. But another thing that I want to do is I want to just come in here and grab this and come down to the bottom and do a little trick that I used to use, which is uh, go into the AI writing over here and we're going to add an FAQ. So I'm going to take the FAQ right over here. It's going to uh, include the following basic terms right over here. We're going to include the following ex extended terms right over here. We can change this. I'm going to say, informal and we could put a heading if we want but we're going to leave it as faq and i'm going to say write for me and the ai is going to heading cannot be empty okay so we'll just say i'm actually going to say zebra cat ai q so frequently asked questions and then write for me so at this point we are doing some intentional seo on page seo stuff right we're injecting nlp lsi keywords and you can see that we, just, we were able to achieve a 72 with just one click with AI, right? So we'll go take a look at these real quick. ZebraCat AI FAQ, what is ZebraCat? Right over here, we might wanna take that one out. We already answered that, but can ZebraCat AI help with marketing? Yes, it can. Is ZebraCat AI easy to use? What are the key features? How does ZebraCat AI revolutionize content creation? And I will say that the reason why I am careful with using an FAQ or using AI for my reviews is that when these reviews hit AppSumo, right, they're brand new, the world may not even know about them yet, and I might actually be the first to actually do an in-depth review of the actual software. And that's why I really like a tool like VideoTap to get the job done because it's using my video and my expertise. When you're using tools like NeuronWriter and so forth, it's going to be pulling information from 
those top results, right? Some of this information might even be from my YouTube post. I think my YouTube video uh, was ranking it. It might even be in there. So you're pulling information that sometimes when you type in something like this and there isn't any good articles out there, then you're going to, that's when you you run the risk of getting AI gibberish, right? And, and you could penalize or hurt your website by putting false information because the AI really doesn't have any good information to write about, right? But in this case, I think ZebraCat was a big software. There's probably a lot, you know, if you're going to use this strategy, I would actually go and type in zebra cat ai review you can see i'm ranked number one and you know zebra cat it's going to be pulling from g2 from trust pilot app sumo captura medium so people that have put out you know doing their parasite seo we've got linkedin and medium i mean just how crappy is google search results these days guys right when you have sites like medium and linkedin ranking in the top 10 it's crazy and then app sumo's ranked in the top 10 like three times as well I, I just think that the, the Google search results are crap right now. The site itself, you know, is barely ranking in the top search results. But nonetheless, I think there's enough information out there that we would be getting some decent information. Okay, so I would do that check just to make sure. But you can see we just raised this to a 72 because when we go back out of this, you'll be able to see that we can go to terms. Now look at all the green. It looks like Christmas time now. Look at all the green that we have that we are using, right? So I'm okay with the where we're at with the 72. That is pretty cool. I mean, this is only an 800 word article. That's not even a 1000 words. That is crazy. I'm going to go ahead and actually highlight this right click and do my own test. So this is less than a 1000 words. This is what I think is also a factor. We don't want a 3000 word AI article on our site, right? We want it to be right to the point. What is the pricing? Here's the questions that people have, and then be done with it, right? So this definitely raised the SEO score. I'm going to go and make sure everything looks good, make sure the pricing is good, maybe add a table and so forth. I'm not going to make you sit through that in this video. I'm going to go and publish this and I'm going to track it in SERP Robot. And then I'll keep you guys updated in the next couple of weeks where we end up landing for this review. But if you want a powerful combination of tools, go pick up Neuron Writer, go pick up VideoTap. They're both leaving in the next two days. So go pick up this possibly potent combination. And thanks for joining me. Make Make sure to subscribe if you're new and I'll see you in the next video.